I just got home from Pilates and he was here waiting for me. The only noise I like to hear in the morning. This machine. Good morning everyone. Welcome to a new vlog. Slightly different setting to the last vlog. I must say it's not quite as nice weather. Um, I'm currently looking at the snow and the, the rain that is falling down in Manchester. Um, not quite Spain, but we're here with another vlog. I'm just gonna vlog the next few days. I actually went to a Pilates class this morning that you will have seen. I almost didn't go. I booked it via class pass yesterday or the day before. Um, and if you don't know about class pass, it's just an app where you can book like loads of different gym classes without like committing to a membership at the actual gym so you can try those different classes it's really good i'll link it down below um so i booked it on class pass my alarm went off at five to seven and i actually woke up at ten past seven and the class started at 7 30 so i had like 20 minutes to get there to get up get dressed and get there which is obviously just not much time at all i went on class pass on the app to cancel the class and it was going to charge me 17 pound to cancel this class like usually when you cancel a class via class pass if it's like within a few hours then you will get charged but i think it's usually like 10 or like 12 pound which i know isn't ideal but it was 17 pounds so i got my ass out of bed and went to the class and i'm so glad i did so today i am spending the day inside like the weather here is so miserable in manchester so i'm shooting some content from home i'm shooting a video for bondi sands which is why i'm only adding a little bit of concealer and a little bit of makeup because i will be applying fake tan so i don't want to like have a full face of makeup on um and then i'm going to shoot a reel for some outfit inspiration like outfits that i've been wearing recently um, and then i also have some ugc content to do for a brand which is like a mushroom um mushroom blend like tea okay this is what we're working with i just wanted to look like i'm wearing no makeup but i'm just a little bit bronzed and eye breakouts aren't quite as obvious okay so i'm ready to start filming now i've just put on like a little boob tube and some pants just so i can like obviously fake tan i'm just in my bedroom against this white wall and then I am shooting on my phone. If any of you have an Apple Watch, this is an absolute game changer if you're a content creator. So if you go on camera app, and then that is the picture from my phone there. So I'll set my phone up, um, and then I can see, sorry, I can see exactly what I'm filming. I, can, I know like I'm in the frame, and like I'm central, and I know it's recorded. And then you can literally just click record there and then we're recording so that is a tip if you if you're a content creator and you have an apple watch it's changed my life i finally finished filming my tanning routine and oh my god that was so hard to do like normally you would fake tan you would just have no clothes on and just obviously apply the tan but because I was wearing like a little boob tube top I still had knickers on it was so hard to like get the tan looking as good as it normally would you know what I mean but anyway I've done it um just waiting for it to dry um I this is an express one so I leave it on for an hour and a half um ish if I've got longer then I'll leave it longer but yeah last time I used it, it was an hour and a half and it looked really really nice so um yeah this is my um fake tan dressing gown it's like a vintage um like kimono style i got it actually from a vintage shop in london like like eight years ago or something but it's turned into my uh fake tan dressing gown look out there you can't really see but it's snowing so hard obviously it's like raining too so it's not sticking but wowie this is the tan i was using by the way it's a one hour express Bondi Sands, I will link it below. But yeah, I've only used it once before, but honestly, it was like the best tan I think I've ever used. And it was only 18 pound. I used to use the Barley Body one, uh, the One Hour Express from Barley Body, but that was like 30 pound a bottle. It was sim similar size to this. Obviously, you can see my neck and my hands are so much darker than my face, but I do not apply fake tan to my face. I am gonna make a coffee 
I think it's what, about 12.30. And then I'm gonna plan some outfits for the reel that I'm gonna shoot later on today. So let's do that. Does anyone else's cat sit with their arms like wide like this? Like wherever he is, his arms are like spread wide. Is it comfy? finished result of the Bondi Sands. So it's a little bit later now. I have had my lunch, just done my makeup. I finished filming the uh, Bondi Sands video, so I'll insert it um, somewhere in this video and you can have a look. Or a link in the description actually, you can go and watch it. Um, but I've just had lunch, done my makeup and I've planned my outfit so as you can see them like all dotted around here. So I'll just show you what I'm shooting. So these are all outfits I've worn recently. I posted this outfit on Instagram this morning. Posted that the other day and then there's a jacket that needs to go with that. And then here is another. These are just, well, that's washing. These are just like uh, recent outfits um, that I wanted to share as a reel. Oop, I'm not focused. That I wanted to share as a reel. So I'll show you where I'm gonna do it. Can I say hi? Hello. Hello, <laughs> it's on his lunch break. So normally I would stand here and film here, but this, the kitchen is a little messy. Because this area here is looking quite cute. I'm gonna shoot here. So I've just set my tripod up. And I feel like iPhone quality when it's going dark is just like so bad that I would have just got pissed off and wanted, wanted to just refilm it another day. So I'm glad I've got that done, but this room is a shit tip. So I'm gonna tidy it up and then I'm gonna edit my content. So it's done. Um, what is going on here? And I'm gonna go meet my friend for a coffee and a catch up because we haven't seen each other in ages. Um, but I've literally just washed and blow dried my hair really, really quick because it was in dire need and I've got like quite a busy morning. So just done that and now I'm running late, so I'm gonna go. Hello again. So I just finished having coffee with my friend and a catch up, it was so nice. We got to see each other in ages. Um, we had a coffee and a croissant in Poland, in Ancoats. Um, and then I went home, brushed my teeth, and now I'm on the way to the dentist because some of you might know I did have a, uh, a fixed brace last year. And there's just a few little things that I want changed into my bottom teeth, which I'm quite happy with. And also my retainer on the back of my top teeth is coming loose so they're gonna like re-glue that down um so yeah I'll check in when i leave but i'm a little bit early though so i'm just walking around trying to kill a bit of time i've just popped into this shop 
and how gorgeous are these plates? And I love these, just like plain shallow plates. And butter. And these got little munching, little espresso things. We definitely need some new bowls and plates because loads of ours have cracked or chipped or we've broken it. Um, so we just don't have like a full set. But I don't know how much do plates and bowls. How much are they even gonna cost? Like I don't know if these are expensive or about right. But I do really love these. Like, love that. But there's no actual plates to match. They're like almost like a bit of a bowl. Hmm. Wow, look at this set. I can imagine that in like a sushi restaurant, like a Japanese -y. So beautiful. Love that. I'm home. So. I ended up buying some bowls. So I wasn't gonna buy anything, but we actually do need some bowls. Um, I really wanted matching set, like matching bowls with the plates, but the bowls that I like, they didn't have plates in the, in the collection, which is just really odd. Ideally, I would have wanted like a matching set, but I just really love these bowls and we really do need them for like, pasta dishes and like salads you know when like a small bowl is just not big enough um so i really love them and they had 10 percent off um these are the bowls that i went for they're like a creamy color with like little speckles on they were all like all completely different all like slightly different shapes which i love i feel like they're just an all-round um good kind of dish to have and then so i got two of those and they were they were maybe £20 each and they were £13 each so that, I thought that was really good um, and then I got two of these as well which are the same from the same collection these are from the same collection but these are obviously a different colour they're a lot more speckled and they look a bit lighter on the camera but they're actually more like a peachy colour um, but I just thought these were like really nice together again it's like slightly different shapes um, bit wonky like I really love that and the small bowls um they were meant to be 16 I think and they were down to like 10 so they were really really good yeah I'm still what are you doing are you playing are you playing hey You too. Nell always teases him, and then as soon as he actually starts to play, look at look at him. He's only patting her, and the noises she comes out with. You're just so extra, aren't you?